Certainly. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to use the polygon EOAP to list all stock ticker symbols using Python. Polygon EO is a financial market data platform that provides real-time and historical data for stocks, options, forex, and crypto. Step 1. Sign up for Polygon EO1. Create an account. Go to Polygon EO it's Polygon EO and sign up for a free account. Get your API key after signing up. You will receive an API key. This key is essential for making requests to the Polygon EO app. Step 2. Set up your Python environment 1. Install required packages. You will need the requests library to make up requests to the Polygon EO app. If you don't have it installed, you can do so using pip. Imports. We import the requests library to handle HUP requests. Function get tickers API key constructs the API or using your API key. Makes a get request to the API. Checks for successful responses and parses the chun data. Returns a list of tickers if found. Main function you need to replace your API key with your actual polygon EO API key. Calls the get tickers function to retrieve the tickers and prints each ticker along with its name. Step 5 running the script 1. Save the script, save the above code in a file named Polygon Tickers Pi. Run the script, use the command line to navigate to the directory where your script is saved and run bash Python Polygon Tickers Pi additional notes pagination depending on your plan and the number of tickers you may need to handle pagination. The app may return a limited number of tickers per request. You can check the next rule in the response to fetch more data. API limits be aware of the API call limits imposed by your polygon. EO plan to avoid being rate limited. Error handling ensure to handle errors gracefully in production code, especially network related issues. Conclusion UV now set up a simple Python script to list all stock ticker symbols using the Polygon Yo API. You can expand this functionality by adding more features, such as filtering tickers based on specific criteria or fetching additional details about each ticker. Happy coding!